Hello everyone, it is FinPlays here, back in another video, hope you guys are doing amazing. Um, I am sorry, it has been just a bit, I know it's been like probably 5 days since my last video, and uh, I'm sorry, I haven't been getting videos as fast as possible. I've been super busy guys, mainly with uh, work and school, <laughs> I started school and you know, family and girlfriend and stuff, so <laughs> yes, I have a girlfriend. <laughs> um, but... I'm happy I'm here, you guys. We are so close to 10,000, and I can't wait to do a live stream. But I have a lot of videos coming still, like I said, and they're all just coming out one by one. Um, I'm sorry. Like, this one was just super quick, super easy. So we'll get this done, in, and then I'm still going to start working on my other videos that are coming. Um, if you are new to my channel, hit that subscribe button and that post notifications. It means so much to me, guys. Like, it, it, is, it is amazing. We have a lot of people who aren't subscribed. It's kind of sad, but, you know, that's just what you have to deal with here on YouTube. Um, and also, join the Discord because it is in the description, and if you do join, we can help be out there i help out a lot of people when i just talk to them because uh that's something we do um so today we are going to be talking about a teleport system now uh, a lot of people are probably like uh completely what are you really talking about um i am talking about a teleport system that you can use um for players to teleport to certain bricks now this isn't a teleport system to certain games this is teleporting to certain uh bricks and parts as you can see i have three of them right here and they are different um but let's just actually hop into how to do this so you're going to go into the description and look for models and you're going to look at the link and you will grab the model now i will put this link on the screen right now so give me a second so this is what it's going to look like. It's going to say top bar teleport system. It's going to say item owned. and I mean, well, it shouldn't say item owned. You're going to have to click it until it says item owned. Now, once you get this, this means you own it. Um, this means you will have this in your inventory for you to download. Now, you can actually download here and do it another way, but I recommend just grabbing the model because it's super easy. Um, but you'll go to toolbox, open toolbox, go to inventory, and just grab this teleport pop top bar system, whatever it says. Um, and basically, inside, we have a folder, and it says ungroup in certain places. So we're going to bring this to replicate storage service script service starter player scripts by going to starter player and going to starter player scripts and we're gonna ungroup this in workspace now what we're gonna do is gonna right click and do that or you can click it and do control U whatever minds your business whatever is easier for you now we have a few things we have a folder of the teleports we have a folder for the modules teleport event teleport script and a teleport top bar now I want to inform you a few things if you are here from a bunch of my vibe videos or just in general uh, you can honestly just remove uh, don't worry about importing this just keep the other module folder you have so just get make sure to get rid of this if you already have that and then down here in this teleport top bar I'm gonna show you guys what we did and how you can add it to your other teleport top I mean your other top bar but um Basically, what we have here is we have teleports, and we name them 1, 2, and 3. So, we're actually going to create a new one, actually, real quick with you guys. And we'll go like that, and we're going to go yellow for this one, and we'll go call it teleport 4. Now, what we're going to do is we are going to look at teleport event and the script and the local script. So, teleport event is for sending an event to the server side and letting the server know that we want a player to teleport to a certain brick or teleport to brick in general or they clicked something and we want to send it up to the server so that is what this is here for now on the local side we're sending the player we're letting them click a gui that's only theirs and when they click it it sends an event up to the server side and lets the server know that we need to teleport them to a certain position now in the main script um it's pretty simple and then in this big one it's a little bit different now the main script i'll just go off it right now um Basically, we have the teleport event, which is located in game.replicate storage right here. And then we do is on server event, we grab the player and the position. Um, what we do is we create a new teleport point, which is going to be game.workspace.teleports. And we're going to find first child and position is equal to any of these teleports. So if it's one through four, any of these names, then that is what we're going to be teleporting to by going into the player, grabbing their character, grabbing their humanoid root part, then the C frame of that humanoid root part and teleporting them to that C frame of that now i recommend positioning these up and high and make sure to turn the can collide off and anchored on because we don't want them to collide with them but they cannot work if they are like in some like uh something is like in if you spawn them on the floor it's just going to get them in the floor so don't do that um then of course we have the local script so we grab the icons the themes the player the teleport event and then telly one telly two telly three now what we're going to do for telly four we're going to go right here and we're going to copy that and we're going to make a new variable and for this variable we are going to call it teleport four now i know that's funny why that thing's going down i need to fix that a bit but so we're going to call it teleport four oh i did not mean to do that 
uh, teleport four right there and we'll do that just a little comment to make it organized um, and what we have right here is the main script now only thing you really need to worry about but we're gonna talk about it so I just created a new one so what you're gonna do is you're gonna control C from you know you can do from here to here I put it down you just hit control C and then <laughs> I just spit everywhere and go like that and then we'll do teleport four dot name because that's just something new vibe gradient works and then we'll do teleport four dot name so talking about the server side we're doing that event we're firing the server when they click the button and we're firing this teleport for so when we tell it for sending up this teleport uh right in here and it's dot name and then what this is going to do is look if that teleport is in that folder and if it is then we're going to send it to that one so um you know honestly we could just do uh any of the teleports but that's not what we're looking for so we're, we're doing any all of them um, but what we're doing is we're creating a new icon setting the drop down square corners to true and we're setting the name to drop down icon uh, this is the image I actually forgot to change the image to like a drop down or like something fun so I'm sorry about that uh, but we're setting the icon to the right so this is what I did cool about this is I put it more to the right screen instead of the left because why do that? Um, and of course we have teleport. You can change this right here by, you know, you can go B. This is for um, if they have a keyboard, they can teleport by just clicking a mouse button or whatever, a keyboard button. And then there's the themes right here. So if you want to change the theme, feel free to just go into modules and look at themes down in here. And these are the themes that we have. I did vibe gradient. There's blue also and default. So you can look at that. Um, but it's really simple and then of course right here you just need to change the name so if you want to say beach this house this anything like that and now what this is doing is creating more little tiny things so what we're gonna do is actually play real quick and show you exactly what it is it's it's pretty simple pretty cool um, and I don't want this video to be long so we're gonna play this test it out and show you so of course you can see as a dance animation thing but it is on the right side it's up here and it is on the right side I put it on the right because it's much better so we have one two three and four so when you click this it has all the teleports open and you can teleport to any of those so I click one you'll tell me more there teleport three teleport three and teleport four <laughs> sorry my name's slurring I'm slurring so yeah that's pretty much it pretty simple um i thought top bar is much easier much much faster and just is more cleaner in my opinion um now if you are wanting something like a gui I'd, i'll put a video in the description uh i think gamer m8 he's pretty good at this and he actually did a gui version so i recommend go checking that out but i think personally the top bar is super clean super easy um and very nice in general um but yeah you guys thank you so much uh let me just quickly show you how to add this to your original top bar so let me put that to that real quick so basically kind of just going off what you're going to do is let's just say you have the top bar vibe ui bundle and stuff so i'm um, and, and replicated so see how this is in here feel free to keep this one instead so i actually will grab that one and then i'll just delete the other one and then for started ui we'll just you know whatever we'll just grab this started ui and ungroup and then we're gonna grab the main one this is the main thing right here so now we're gonna put this in here Go into this main script and then actually instead what we're going to do is we're going to grab these boop and then we're going to go right here go like that and just paste that right there and then we're going to grab this wow whole thing so all of this go right there go to settings now since we don't have this this new one we'll just actually just go right down here and paste it and there we go that's all we need so let me just test this out and make sure this works but um it should just work like that so give me one second Okay, so as you can tell, we have all the new ones up here, the shop, the settings, all that. So that that's basically what we have. And then we have the teleport. And yes, it works perfectly fine. So that's pretty much it, you guys. I hope you did enjoy this video. Please comment, like, subscribe, and share. Now, I do have the Vibe game coming out really soon and the whole kit. Um, I know you guys are probably looking at my profile like, Twin, make that uncopy locked. I don't have anything in there right now. I need to set it up. It's going to take me a while because I actually want to make sure everything is perfect and there's no bugs, no nothing like that. There's going to be a little, maybe like one or two bugs for sure, but I just want to make sure everything's high quality and you guys are going to be able to use it. Now, uh, yeah, you guys, I'll see you in another video. Let's get to 10,000. Subscribe, comment, like, and share. Peace out.